Hi guys, welcome back to another one. This is actually part two of the video that I did before where I attempted to breed a famous horse. Um, I've actually done a second part of this, but when I did it, unfortunately, I could not get it to work out right. I, I just, just didn't happen. So we're going to try again and we'll see what we do. All right. Oh, it's a bay, but it is not a thoroughbred. We're looking for a bay thoroughbred right now. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to buy a gross potion because I really want to just end up a uh, newest. I want to grow it up. All right, and we're going to try again, but before then we're going to go over and we're going to look on lunar islands for stuff. Also, I have a couple of horses to show y'all that are actually available if anyone is wanting to, I don't know, if you're just interested in one, if you want to offer for one. Oh wait, never mind. I thought those, okay, here's one. And it is a Akultechi with a black thoroughbred coat. This is a fail from another video. Don't mind that, that's just my main account. Okay. Alright. We're gonna go overhead. Go overhead. <laughs> We're gonna go over here and see what we have here. Okay, it looks like we just have a Carmelo and a... Wait, what's the, what's the other rare one? It says there was three rare on Lunar. Oh. Oh, is this Dapple? I'm, I'm an idiot. Okay. I do not need stallions. I do need mares, so I would consider a mare, but I do not need stallions. Okay, so we have this absolutely gorgeous little Akultechi here. We also have this one. She, he is a black Arabicano. Very beautiful boy, but once again, they're just horses I don't really need right now, and I just need the inventory space more than anything. Um, what's the other one? Okay, I have this Clydesdale. It was part of a co-breeding, but I have a lot of them on my main account, so if you're wanting to offer for it, just go right ahead. Then I have another thoroughbred coat, which is this bay, and it is an Akultechi. If you want to offer for any of this, do not, I, I, I'm serious, do not hesitate to get right in there and ask about it, because I'm definitely, definitely looking for, um homes for some of these because I don't want to just sell them off but I can't really keep all of them so I am going to sell these ones that I've already uh, bred with I'm not selling that because I caught this gold black uh, fjord with a black mane and tail and I just think it looks it's just so cute and then we have this palomino which I am going to sell because I just don't need another palomino all right is that all Let's see here. Oh, I can sell this hay. I don't really need it. It doesn't offer much bond to my horses anyways. Uh, I'll sell all these stones. I've gotten so many stones ever since I started collecting for these solar stones, which I know is common. That's just what happens. But I was just surprised by how many stones I got. All right, let's go ahead and get back on our main horse here. Guys, in a new... In another video, I'm going to be picking some names for some of my best horses or my favorite horses on here. And I want y'all to, you've been so great with the name suggestions so far. Could you put some name suggestions for her in the comments? Because she really needs a name. Look, she has no name. <laughs> poor girl. She's a poor no-named little baby. And I would love to give her a beautiful name. She's going to be getting a beautiful brand new tax set in an upcoming video. So she needs a nice new name to go along with her nice new tax set. Is that a quarter horse or is that a... It is a quarter horse. Alright. Ooh, we got a flower seed. That is awesome. I love flower seeds. Not going to get that just because it takes a long time and I feel like it's kind of boring just to sit there and watch me chip away at Moonstone. <gasps> is that an Ackleton? No, nope, it's not. Paint horse. Mm -hmm. By the way, I saw a video the, the other day. Is that a... Guys, is that... Guys, I'm honestly really bad at this. I can't tell. Is that just a black man tail or is that obsidian? Probably just a black man tail, but I better catch it anyways. Just in case. Come here, baby. Yeah, just black. I think it's just how my uh, 
computer like the settings here are. I always have to get the turquoise flowers. I don't know why, they're just my favorite. Alright, let's run on up here. I don't know exactly how many more breedings I have because I'm not sure how many of you know my, my bay teaks I have left. But we'll go ahead and look. Oh, that's a gorgeous, gorgeous boy. Oh, so pretty. Every time I see some of the thing with a Palomino mane, though, I, I automatically wonder whether it is a um <laughs> a moonstone mane and tail. I'm not 100% sure if you can actually have those. I think those are a thing. I'm just going to head back and breed again, and that way we can just... We can just head back and look at the rest of Lunar Islands after we have bread again. Also, guys, if y'all have... This is going to be a weird request. But if you have any villain names, I would like villain names. They can be uh, men, women, anything. I just need some villain names. I have some... Well, some of them aren't villain names, but a lot of them... I don't know, I guess they could be considered as villains, but you know how that is. Okay, I don't have one on this account, on this one, so... There's one. I'm an idiot, I literally just... Joanna has new brains. Joanna also needs to bond up this. This is one from my main account, someone traded it to me. Or I bought it, I don't remember what it is. It's a very interesting looking horse. I used to really dislike it. It's kind of grown on me. I kind of like it now. I like it a lot more when the saturation is up and it doesn't look like a poop stain. I'm sorry, but that is honestly what this coat looks like if it's if the saturation is turned way down. Yeah, look at that. Poop stain. Maybe it's the contrast as well. Kind of. Sorry guys, I'm just messing around here. I love that so much. Okay, eat up. Come on, spit spat. I really, really hope this is the one. Okay, because... Oh, I'm still feeding him. I don't know why. Her, sorry, her. She also needs a name, but I'm afraid to give her one because I think mine would be too offensive. <laughs> Poor girl, because I just don't love that coat. Oh my goodness, we got it. We got our horse. Guys, it's our horse. This is our horse. Okay, guys, this is our horse. All right, we have found it. We have found our horse. Now, remember how I asked you all guys to guess along and kind of tell me what you thought this horse would be? All right, well, first off, we got to go and get to change this uh what kind of stats does it have? Pretty good stats. Nice. We gotta go change the mane and tail on here because this ain't cutting it. This is not gonna cut the mustard. But we have found our horse, guys. It's very slow. Needs some training up. Let's go see if they have any dyes because I would ideally like its hair to be... Oh, nope. It's not gonna do it. What do I have here? Oh yeah, I have one winter fade dye if anyone's looking for winter fade dye. Okay, so I am actually going to style the hair longer. Style my horse. Style this horse. Okay, long and blunt. I feel like this is pretty good. Sometimes... Uh, uh, I feel like that could also be it. But I think we'll just go back to short. Alright, so. Once these hair dyes reset, we're going to come back and see if we can find any black or brown. And as for right now, we're going to head over to Larry and we're going to get some gorgeous, uh, make sure we have enough leather to make this beautiful boy his tack. Why am I selling stuff? Because I'm an idiot. 
I'd also ideally like to get up above um, 100,000 again before the next video. So we'll see how that works out. Okay, guys, so as I do this, I would like y'all to, to guess again. This is a famous, it's, uh, you, you'll be able to tell as soon as I start making the tack for it. So we're going to go to bridles and harnesses. We don't want a jumping bridle, we want a English bridle. Probably a fancy English bridle would be fine. And we're going to make it out of black, just because, just what it's going to be. Next, we're going to do our saddle. And for this horse, it has got to be... Oh, goodness. I forgot to do the tear. The right tear. Okay. I'm going to do a black and black. And so for this, we're going to go ahead back to the bridles. Make another fancy English obsidian tear black bridle. All right. Next, we're going to need a saddle pad. So... Go ahead and make a saddle pad. I can't decide whether I'm going to go with white or with black. I think I might have one already. So, guys, what I'm going to go ahead and do is, you see now that it's, I have an English bridle. I have a uh, racing saddle. So, let me know whether y'all can tell what horse I am making. This is a very famous horse. Um, may not be exactly the correct color, but it's the closest I could find to the color. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and see... Well, no, I don't want that saddle pad. It's going to be like a big, fat saddle pad. Why am I doing this? I should just be crafting. This is what I want, I think. Yeah, that's perfect. Alright, so. Here it is, guys. All right, very famous horse. I will actually have an episode coming up on this horse um, where I, all I will be doing is basically uh, doing a little kind of a fun um, thing about this horse. But since we've taken so long breeding him, uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to train him. No, we're not going to train agility. Okay. He's a speedy boy. We're going to trade his speed and his stamina both to max. Just because I want to. Alright. Whoa, look at how fast he is. Amazing. Um, Let's see. So, do we have any of these sun stones? Oh, she's new. She's new hair dies. All right, let's see if she has the one I want. Oh, goodness, I don't want dark gray. Ideally, it would be brown or black. I used to have a lot of black, but I'm using a lot of black for this new project. Hang on, I'm going to go ahead and look up and see what color mane and tail this horse actually had. Because I'm like 98% sure I know what color they had, but then I wouldn't want to, you know, do it. And then everyone else is like, hey, that's not actually the color that the horse had. Sorry, I'm watching a... I was watching a video. So if you hear it on the background... Uh-oh, my ringtone. Alright, uh... Let's see... So this horse was a light bay. Honestly, from the pictures, it looks about the same color as mine. And let's just see what color. All right, so it needs a black mane and tail to be entirely accurate to the... Uh, goodness, how many do I have? I have 19. Goodness me. Anyways, so um, this is a famous horse. He was a light bay. He raced a lot. So you know now he's a racehorse. He's a famous racehorse, light bay, raced a while back and was very prominent. He's had a movie about him and several books. I own a lot of the books about him. And honestly, he's just one of the most fantastic racehorses. 
if you if you think of the if well when I think of the top racehorses ever, he is definitely among them. I mean, wonderful, awesome racehorse. And so Oh my goodness, I wish I could get the black hair dye because I really do need it. I'll put in, if I can find black hair dye in another market, I'll dye his hair and I'll put in the clip of it for y'all. Just so y'all can see, I actually did dye his hair black. Alright, let's see what we get. Oh, more surfboards. I have so many surfboards right now, guys. All right, well, I will see you all in the... Well, actually, no, because I have to add in another little part once I dye his man tail. All right, guys, see you in the next part. Bye-bye. All right, I just wanted to say hello to uh, Marielle. I'm not exactly sure how to say your name, so I'm just going to say it as uh, Marielle. I don't know, Marielle. Um, I just want to say thank you for coming over and saying hi during the game. I was really surprised by that. I honestly didn't think anybody would recognize me for a long time yet. So you absolutely made my day by coming over and saying hi. Um, by the way, everybody, look at that wonderful, stunning horse she has there. It's a rose gray uh, thoroughbred from the training island. And I've honestly never seen one that color. They're so pretty. And y'all make sure to say hi right back to her because she said hi here. And she was so lovely, and I actually am going to have a clip in an upcoming video, so don't you let the secret out. I'm going to have a clip in an upcoming video because we ended up co-breeding, and we got a really fantastic horse, okay guys? So, thank you again, Mario, for coming over and saying hi, and anytime you all see me in-game, you make sure to come over and say hi. I absolutely love it. Thank you so much again. Alright, on to the next a clip. Seabiscuit, who was foaled in 1933, was an American thoroughbred that was a grandson of the famous racehorse Man of War. In six seasons, 1935 through 1940, he won 33 of his 89 races and a total of $437,730, a record for American thoroughbreds that remained unbroken until 1942. Welcome home, Seabiscuit. Welcome home.